Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 19 in chapter 29. Chapter 29 is about electromagnetic induction and Faraday's law. So there we have a circular loop, right? And in this loop diameter is given, resistance is given. The magnetic field is perpendicular to this loop, and it changes from the 0 0.4 to the 0, right? It's initially 0 0.4, and finally it is removed from the field, so that means it's 0. So we can write down the change of magnetic field and time taken is given at 0. Ask you to find the electric energy in this process. So electric energy we can consider as a power times the T, right? Next question. What is power? Power is come from the induced EMF. So we can use induced EMF squared divided by R. This equation comes from the Ohm's law. You can, if you don't understand, you can check the Ohm's law chapter. And then we look at the epsilon, right? Epsilon EMF, there is the change of magnetic influence divided by time taking. So this is delta B times A divided by delta T. So the delta A can be pi squared, pi R squared, so pi diameter squared divided by 4, right? Now you input the R inside in this uh, power P and then times delta T. So this is the electric energy. And then replace the epsilon in the function there and reorganize it and input all the given quantities, you can get answer there. Thank you.